Okay. Heavy rainfall triggers devastating floods and landslides in eastern China, resulting in five confirmed deaths and three individuals still missing. Additionally, more than 2,500 residents have been forced to evacuate their homes, as reported by state media on Sunday. China National Radio disclosed that the floods inundated a village situated in the Fuyang district of Hangzhou city, submerging numerous houses during Saturday afternoon. Subsequently, the continuous rain caused a partial mountain collapse and mudslide, impacting various areas within the district and leading to power outages in over 1,600 households. The Xinhua News Agency confirmed the evacuation of over 1,500 people. China frequently experiences seasonal flooding, primarily in the semi-tropical southern regions. Nevertheless, this year has witnessed unusually severe floods in some northern areas, the worst in half a century. The torrents have affected various parts of the country this month, resulting in casualties. Earlier in the month, floods in the southwestern Chongqing region claimed the lives of at least 15 individuals. Reports from Sunday indicated that torrential rain transformed numerous streets in Liaoning, a northeastern province, into flowing rivers, compelling the evacuation of 5,590 people. Approximately 30 houses and 54 hectares of crops sustained damage in the region. In Hubei, a central province, relentless rainstorms left some residents stranded in their vehicles and homes. By Saturday night, Authorities had successfully rescued or evacuated around 220 individuals in Xianning City. It is important to note that China experienced its deadliest and most destructive floods in recent history in 1998, when approximately 4,150 people lost their lives, with the majority of the fatalities occurring along the Yangtze River. Disaster authorities have reported a tragic toll in the wake of severe flooding that has struck parts of Hubei province in central China. As of the latest update, 21 individuals have tragically lost their lives, and the whereabouts of four others remain unknown, adding to the distressing impact of this natural disaster. This relentless flood event has cast a long shadow over a wide expanse encompassing seven cities and 22 counties within Hubei province. An astounding 384,800 people have been directly affected by the deluge, necessitating the relocation of 11,000 individuals to temporary accommodations as the torrential waters ravaged more than 3,600 homes. The heart-wrenching loss of lives has been most pronounced in the township of Lulin, situated in the city of Suizhou, in the northern reaches of the province. Here, floodwaters surged to an alarming depth of nearly 2.5 meters, and it is in this location that the 21 fatalities were recorded. The valiant efforts of emergency services led to the rescue of over 500 individuals who found themselves in peril. The Hubei Emergency Management Department has provided insight into the meteorological conditions that precipitated this tragedy. A total of 16 meteorological monitoring stations located in Yicheng, Xiangcheng, Nanjiang, Zaoyang, and Suixian of Suizhou detected extreme rainfall of unprecedented proportions. In response to this crisis, 
The Provincial Emergency Management Department acted swiftly by distributing vital relief supplies, including tents and folding beds, to the flood-stricken victims in Suizhou City. The National Meteorological Center has issued a grave warning, indicating the presence of a stationary storm in the middle and lower reaches of the Yangtze River.